the moment the moment namwambia i drop it down from social media and i bet it went to the bottom yet he paid me 500 shillings it's not even fair at all i felt like i should put it out he was a scam then he see and i will make him believe like content like is real Yes, Thank you very much. I think uh, it's it's lit out there. <laughs> so thank you once again for joining me for another episode of uh, the Bank series. This is a second episode, but actually it's just a follow up of the first episode. I had to redo this. I had to redo this because of what happened in the first episode. First of all, let me just show you. I have a copyright strike from who? Denisi himself. This is a copyright takedown notice and my video will be removed on monday because uh, the copyright takedown notice was issued to me on 25th of april meaning uh on 2nd may i'll have my video youtube will have to remove the first episode of the bank series from the youtube channel very bad start anyway so uh and then my channel will be issued with a copyright strike now this is why i'm saying this because one after the seven days expire youtube will remove my video so just know i will not be paid by anyone to remove the video but until monday when the video will be removed by youtube and two my channel will get a copyright strike because uh, they removed it i have an option of removing it so that i don't get a copyright strike but for this case i'll let youtube remove and then i'll go through the co um, the appeal process or thirdly, I have three options. One, let YouTube remove and then uh, put a copyright strike on my channel. Two, I remove the video and I don't get a copyright strike. Or three, I reach out to Denny C so that he can retract the take down notice. But then I'll leave option one so that it can take place on Monday. So on Monday, if you don't see my video, just know it's YouTube that has removed it because I have a seven days notice. And as per today, which is Saturday, which is Friday, uh, there is Saturday, Sunday, and then there is Monday. So I have three days as I'm recording this video at uh, 11.30 p.m. Now, uh, the video you just watched is for a lady called Kenalia because five, there, there are many things that have happened during that period. And uh, it has touched on this lady. And I'm sure Denis C, since he got my video, he contacted the lady and the lady had recorded a video uh, uh i think uh three minutes eight seconds video uh accusing denisi or rather not accusing exposing denisi and you can look for the video on youtube it's called if you care denisi i will attach the link here so that you can see that video so the, the link is here and it is posted on someone else uh channel this is called marion joseph 251 marion joseph saw the video which was posted by Kenalia. <laughs> this is another story again. I'll get back. I'll I'll tell you whether she's Kenalia or Kelia or Fiona. So Joseph uh, downloaded the video and uploaded it on his channel on April 11th. But NB, she had posted the video on one month ago and she had 20,000 views. That is one month ago. And the video was still there i saw it on wednesday but on thursday it had been removed on her youtube and you can see uh, their youtube canalia and kelia they have 386 subscribers and they only have that one video called uh smash or pass uh, whatever with 964 uh, views that was as per yesterday thursday so as i'm recording this now this is just to prove to you that uh dennis does uh the dirtiest of things so the video that we just watched let me just replay at uh, the part that i started with and this is what they said the moment the moment namabia i dropped it down from social media and i then it went ten thousand mm -hmm. yet he paid me 500 shillings it's not even fair at all i felt like i, I should put it out mm -hmm. you are saying Yes. Then you see, and I will make me believe like content like is real. So then you see, and I will make me believe his content is real. But this is actually an actor in that video of uh, 
um, Honey, but that is part 33 of the NEC. I'll still attach the link here, just like the previous episode. Now, today I don't want to talk much, but I just want to address this, and then I address now the second things for actors and all that. So, this lady, in the first place, uh, let me just uh, uh, play for you now, because uh, <laughs> I think she's confused, by the way, or I don't know who she is. So, in this video, she introduces herself as... Let me just play. Kelia. Yes, my name is Kelia. But on this other video, her name is Sagal Kenalia and Kelia. Sagal Kenalia and Kelia. No, she's now Kenalia. The previous video she was Kelia. But well, she's Fiona in the series she's acting. So that's another key thing. Now, this is the part that I want you to listen as she says what she thinks about Denise. Denise, you're not being fair to girls. <laughs> you're not being fair to girls. You're not. <laughs> Actually, your content is scripted. You called us to act. Them to act. Your content is so scripted and it's even evident. And it's even evident. So I'll leave, it, I'll leave you to go and watch this. The full video here is just three minutes, so I think you can sneak away and then you come back to the lesson deal. Yes, now you are getting the point. Oh, the video is in, on this channel just next to you. You can see if you get any see, it's posted by Marion Joseph 251. So uh, on Thursday, yesterday, the video had 16 views. Now, this is what I want to address now as we talk uh, about being content creator and the like and being actors. As an actor, you need to understand one thing, and this is what now this lady, let me just call her Kelly because I don't know whether she's Kelly, Kelia, or, or Fiona. Let me just use the name Kelly for, this, uh, for the purpose of this video. Now, Kelly needs to understand, or rather any artist, any model, any artist, any actor, any, any cast, any minor, there are things called release forms. Release forms are things that you sign before you let even anybody record you that is uh that is whether you're getting paid or something and i'll just have some two examples there's one here that is uh just got it online for your own purpose and here i will not show you but this is a uh, one called model release form uh, model release agreement from some organization in nairobi uh, i hope you're not going to zoom into it model release agreement and I'll just read a few things from this model release agreement. This uh, agreement, let me, I'll not read everything, but let me just focus on a few things here, where it talks about uh, the person releasing their, their consent for their image to be used for a certain period, because they are going to get paid uh, by being a model in this uh, advert. So, one, uh, let me just ignore everything and read the last part. Say, so you, and your licensees, assignee, or clients shall have unrestricted use of the said material for an indefinite period for whatever purpose you may think fit. The key word here is indefinite period for whatever purpose you may think fit. Indefinite, indefinite uh, period. Then, this is a cast release form I got from Dreamcatcher Productions. Dreamcatcher Productions Limited, that is in 2011. I worked there as an artist, so um, you can now do whatever you want to do with that information. This is a cast release form. This was a model release agreement. This is a cast release form. I'll read you a statement where it says, let me just read like, I am the one who is signing this cast release form. From Maestro, in consideration of agreement to pay a legal fee of the original agreed fee, which is, let me use just some figure there, uh, 5,000, then amount in words only, as a cancellation fee of acting in the TV commercial, whatever bank logo reveal, to be used for two years in Kenya only. This one has a period where you can allow your image to be used by the organization so for example i issue i send this form saying that denise can use my 
image to make money with the information with the image of uh, myself acting in whatever even as much as he has paid me he has that uh, he has that 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 right to use my image but again for how long is an indefinite period so let me just take you through now this form that you can see online because uh, these ones I cannot scan and I don't know I don't have uh, rights to <laughs> to share it publicly unless you go and act that you can get so this is a video release form I Mr. official herein authorize someone to use edit copy exhibit distribute and use any video or videos of me for any lawful purpose so technology is a lawful purpose then I'll ignore the second point then the third one now the term of this authorization is indefinite and will be active unless I revoke it in, in writing. So by the fact that you first of all wrote the first agreement that this, uh, the term of this authorization is indefinite, then the second one will be indefinite. Uh, sorry, the fact that you say the, the authorization is indefinite and will be active unless I terminate it in what I revoke it in writing so first of all you have given out your right but then it reaches a point you don't feel like no that's okay so the reason I'm saying this is because of this video of a uh, uh, Kelly uh, Kelly uh, Siona in this uh, in this in this video so this is what she says uh, let me just play for you uh, the part uh, I've actually forgotten uh, the minute because of saying many things so uh, on this minute he says uh let me just play it the moment, the moment. yet he paid me 500 shillings mm. it's not even fair at all i felt like i, I should put it out you are saying then you see and i will make me believe like content so the key thing there is that the moment he got in touch with him to pull down the video, then he asked for ten thousand. Yet he had paid her five hundred chicken shillings. I think that's the part that is not really making sense for her. But you know, if he hadn't signed a cast release or a video release form, then he can do whatever he wants to do, and you can't take him anywhere. No, the thing is, now that you didn't sign that, you can take him to court. You can sue him if you want to. But again. This is just information for all your friends who want to get into modeling, acting, being an artist, and dealing with producers and the like. These people know many things to do with media, and they will manipulate you and make you sign things that you don't want because you just want money, you see. So make sure that every time before you sign these uh, release forms, or before acting, make sure you sign one and have an agreement and read it to understand what you are doing. So with that, I'll just leave it to you so that you can have a good day and have a good time. Make sure you share with your friends and let them focus on the part that they need to know in terms of acting and presenting the image to be used by, by producers.